The design of a racing car is, is a combination of art and engineering. The physics, the engineering tells you whether it will work or not. But it doesn't give the ideas, it doesn't give the inspiration. We've had an approach from Tony to say, would I design a car which didn't respect any regulations, so it's pure purposes to go as fast as possible. Because if we didn't have regulations, then the opportunity exists to make a car that would be really quite obscenely quick around the lap, but pretty uncomfortable to drive just because the G-forces would be so high. リアルとまあバーチャルの接近というのはすでにもう起きていますね。あのフォーミュラーのドライバーでも実際のレースの前にシミュレーターで訓練をしていて。I um, came up with a, a specification for the car, did a few sketches as to how components could be packaged in the shape. Whatever we draw has to respect the laws of physics. えっとね、まず最初の質問から言うと、えー、まあ実際僕らも作ってみて驚いたのが、えー、結構乗りやすい車なんですよね。あの史上最速だろうと思います。Physically build the car that we're describing and get it to do a lap. I don't know what the budget would be for that. It would still be in the order of millions for sure.